Hi, I'm Brian, and I'm 18 years old, and I'm from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. I started out when I was like around 9 years old, having a movie night with my family. As we were heading towards the car park, we stumbled across the ice ring, uh, the Sunway ice ring, and we saw kids playing. I was like, wow, mom, there's ice hockey, I, I want to try it out. So the next day, my mom immediately called up on MIA Chef and they told us that there was a Friday hockey school. My mom just uh, placed me over there and that's when I started. So I started out my position as a, as a defense and then I moved up to being a forward because I find it more interesting. Being in the national team, we have about three to four ice time a week and that's excluding the two gym sessions that we have and following our ice conditions we don't really have a proper ice ring until recently from from Mainis Empire we've been training most of the time at night because we don't have the luxury of getting the ice time in the morning and the afternoon back in my school days I will usually go to school in the morning and when we come back I have to go straight for training if there's gym on that day then I'll go for gym if there's a night training I have to go for both so I usually do my revision when I'm back from night training. Yeah, I would say it's pretty challenging, but then after, after I, f I was done with my SPM, I was, I was pretty happy because I, I get to focus full time on ice hockey. The journey was actually a, a challenging one, for, especially for us students. But I would say it was still a fun, challenging journey, like, you know, go, uh, start, starting late at night, training while feeling tired, worried about the homework that if I done it or not. The only obstacles we have is just the lack of facilities. We want to train in the afternoon so we can rest at night, but we can't because we don't have the, the ice time to do that. So we can only train at night and we have to wake up tired for in the next morning. First of all, I have to thank Mindy's Empire because they gave us free ice time right after they were open. So we could actually train, like we trained properly for the SEA Games. It helped us a lot because they gave us three ice times a day and with that our team could really bond together. My first impression was that it was really beautiful. I felt so proud to be in a national ice hockey stadium that we have never gotten before. Great changing rooms and it, it looked really beautiful. We even have shower rooms, so we don't have to go back smelly. <laughs> we can actually shower there before we're going back. They even place restaurants nearby the rink, so we don't have to go out of the mall just to eat. We have proper food. That's the facilities that we're looking for, actually. I would say that the ice didn't really pose a threat to us. We had a lot of time to get used to it, and the ice was actually really nice. We didn't need much time to get used to it immediately. This is my first international tournament on home grounds with the national team. When I wasn't in the team, they have played countless of international tournaments overseas, but they have never played one proper one in our home grounds in Malaysia itself. It's the home ground advantage that made us feel really proud. There's a difference between other international tournaments overseas and the tournament here in Malaysia. Okay, first of all, our goals is to get at least a medal. We want to reach a goal if possible. We want to make Malaysia proud regardless of what the score is. That's what's most important because ice hockey in a tropical country with no proper facilities, it's really challenging for us. I expect that more youth will start to take up this sport and see it as a fun game for them. With all the challenges that we have, we can't really take Malaysia ice hockey to a higher level than what we are. With SEA Games, we are actually helping to promote ice hockey to all the youths. So they are the ones, they are the generation that will bring ice hockey to the level that we could not bring. Ice hockey at the 2017 Southeast Asian Games.